And obviously no one's here to greet us. How rude. Not even any guards outside. That's bad. You should have at least a couple. You never know who's gonna ch charge right in. Like me! It is very slow. There we go. My lords and ladies of the Landsmeet, Tyrn Loghain would have us give up our freedoms, our traditions, out of fear. He placed us on this path, yet we should place our destiny in his hands? Must we sacrifice everything good about our nation to save it? Good point. Very good point. A fine performance, Aemon. <laughs> But no one here is taken in by it. Didn't you just hear the clapping? You would attempt to put a puppet on the throne, and every soul here knows it. The better question is who will pull the strings. I got no strings to hold me ah! back. Here we have the puppeteer. I don't even have to. I don't even know how to work a puppet. I suck at those. Tell us, Warden. How will the Orlesians take our nation from us? Will they deign to send their troops? Or simply issue their commands through this would-be prince? The Orlesians aren't even here. Who are you talking to? What do they offer you? How much is the price of Ferelden honor now? Listen, buddy. The Blight is the biggest threat here, not Orle. There are enough refugees in Mybanor now to make that abundantly clear. The South has fallen, Loghain. Will you let Darkspawn take the whole country for fear of Orlay? The Blight is indeed real, Wolf. Exactly. But do we need Grey Wardens to fight it? Well, they have been fighting it for the They claim that they alone you know, can end the Blight. Yet they failed spectacularly against the Darkspawn at Ostagar. And they asked to bring with them four legions of Chevaliers. And once we open our borders to the Chevaliers, can we really expect them to simply return from whence they came? Um, yeah, it's incriminate Rendon Howe even more. You allowed him to imprison and torture innocents. The warden speaks truly. My son was taken under cover of night. The things done to him. Some of them are beyond any he healer's looks fine skill. When I found him. How was responsible for himself. He will he answer to the you. Maker for any wrongs committed in this life, as must we all. But you know that. You were the one who murdered him. He deserved it. Whatever How may have done, he should have been brought before the Seneschal. There is no justice in butchering a man in his home. Oh, funny you should bring that up. Why send a blood mace to poison all Eamon then? I assure you, Warden, if I were going to send someone, it will be my own soldiers. I would not trust to the discretion of an apostate. Indeed, my brother tells a very different tale. He says you snatched a blood mage from She's the Chantry's a justice. Lot. Coincidence? Do not think Ooh. the Chantry will overlook this, Terran Loghain. She's mad. Interference in a Templar's sacred duties is an offense against the You do the not maker. piss off a priest. Whatever I have done, I will answer for later. At the moment, however, I wish to know what this warden has done with my daughter. I saved her from your insanity. You took my daughter, our queen, by force. Killing her guards in the process. What arts have you employed to keep her? Does she my even still live? Good looks. I believe I can speak for myself. <gasps> Lords and ladies of Ferelden, hear me. My father is no longer the man you know. This man is not the hero of Riverdale. This man turned his troops aside and refused to protect your king as he fought bravely against the Darkspawn. Ooh, this when man the truth seized comes Caelan's out. throne before his body was cold and locked me away so I could not reveal his treachery. I would have already been killed if not for this Grey Warden. Oh yeah. Listen to Honora. She's clearly in the right mind right now. So, the Warden's influence has poisoned even your mind, Enora. 
I wanted to protect you from this. She's not a little girl. My lords and ladies! Our land has been threatened before! It's been invaded and lost and won times beyond counting. We Ferelden's have proven that we will never truly be conquered so long as we are united. We must not let ourselves be divided now. Stand with me, and we shall defeat even the Blight itself. Too late, buddy. The Warden. I'm with the Warden. Yep. Southreach stands with the Grey Wardens. Oh, yeah. The Warden helped me personally in a family Oh, matter. everyone's behind me. Waking Sea stands with the Grey Warden. Dragon's Peak supports the Warden. The Western Hills throw their lot in with the Wardens. Make her help us. Oh, yeah. I stand by Loghain. Oh, fuck you, man. There's no hope of victory otherwise. All fool. I stand with the Warden. The Blight is coming. We need the Grey Wardens. Thank you. Thank you. Huh, you lose. I like how that's an option. I would usually say that, but let's keep things classy. Lazmeet is against you. Everyone is against you, Loghain. Step down. Gracefully. Traitors! Which of you stood against the Orlesian Emperor when his troops flattened your fields and raped your wives? You fought with us once, Eamon. You cared about nope. this land no, once. Ignoring you. Before no, I don't you got see too you. old no. and fat and content to even That's see nice what roof. you risk. Ooh, look at the carpet. None of you deserve a say in what happens here. None of you have spilled blood for this land the way I have. How dare you judge me? Eesh. Can you gargle anymore? Alright, let's not break out into just pandemonium. Let's have a duel. An honorable one. Then, let us end this. Alright then. I suppose we both knew it would come to this. I suppose when so. When we first met at Ostagar, I would never have thought so. But Ostagar seems like it happened in another lifetime to someone else. A man is made by the quality of his enemies. Marek told me that once. Good saying. I wonder if it's more a compliment to you or me. Enough. Let the landsmeet declare the terms of the duel. It shall be fought according to tradition. A test of arms in single combat until one party yields. Got it. And we who are assembled will abide by the outcome. Will you face me yourself, or have you a champion? No. I'll fight this duel myself. It is you or me the men will follow. So, let us fight for it. Prepare yourself. I've been prepared for a long time. So much silver. It's almost blinding. Ha! Let's wipe them out quickly. Yes. <laughs> ah. And I'm off. Dirty fighting right in front of yes. everybody. Ah. I'm an honorable man. Right. I swear. And I'm off. Going. <laughs> yes. Ah. It's just gonna be a big old slug fest. That's all. Me. Look at that. Who's gonna go down first? Ooh, we've got a hidden. Good for you. Ooh, we've got another one. Oh, damn. Okay. Now things are serious. Ow. 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 All right. And done. Yeah, that's two of them. <laughs> They're multiplying. I underestimated you, Warden. I thought you were like Kalen, a child wanting to play at war. At first I was. I was wrong. There's a strength in you that I have not seen anywhere since Marek died. I yield. Hmm. You know what? Honor made a good, pretty good case for you. Your love for the country was just too strong. So... I guess I can accept your surrender. 
I didn't just hear you say that. You're going to let him live after everything he's done. Kill him already. Right, calm down, Alistair. Wait, there is another option. The Tern is a warrior and general of renown. I suppose. Let him be of use. Let him go through the joining. Uh, wait, what? I didn't exactly think of that. Why make him a warden? There are three of us in all of Ferelden. True. And there are compelling reasons to have as many wardens on hand as possible to deal with the Archdemon. The joining itself is often fatal, is it not? If he survives, you gain a general. If not, you have your revenge. Doesn't that satisfy you? Mm. Absolutely not. Riordan, this man abandoned our brothers and then blamed us for the deed. True. He hunted us down like animals. He tortured you. How can we simply forget that? I don't remember being that? hunted down that badly. Maybe a, one or two times. But Riordan does make a good point. There's so few of us. Huh. One extra warden, plus it would keep him under watch. Hmm. All right. All right, why not? Make him go through the joining. Joining the wardens is an honor, not a punishment. Name him a warden and you cheapen it's us kind all. It's of both, I man. Will not you have to admit stand that. stand next to him as a brother. I won't. You know, not all great wardens have spotless honor. It's like joining the Legion of the Dead. It's like, you got nothing left? Just join the wardens. Die fighting Darkspawn. Some things can't be undone or forgiven. This goes way beyond having spotless honor. We aren't talking about a minor hiccup in his past. I didn't want to be king. I still don't. But... If that's what it takes to see Loghain get justice, then I'll do it. I'll take oh, the crown. No, don't do that, Alistair. Listen to this. Can you see how disastrous a king he'd be? Putting his own selfish desires above the needs of his country? You can't seriously support him. Yeah, Alistair, come on. Be reasonable. Besides, the two of you are going to get married. It's going to be nice. And I thought you weren't going Doves to stab me in, in the, the wind. back. Funny how nothing ever turns out like you thought. Nah, that's Alistair, not fair, Alistair. Compose yourself. Fine. You want Loghain and the Grey Wardens so badly that I'll be leaving the Wardens to marry Honora. I doubt you can just stop being a Warden, Alistair. Watch me. This can be discussed later. We are keeping the lands meet waiting. Okay. Right. <sighs> and now, Lords and Ladies of Ferelden. There is still a blight to defeat, and armies to gather. And I appoint this man to lead us in both. We will not allow this land to be further threatened by the Archdemon. Gather your forces, and await the Warden's command. On the morrow, we shall begin our struggle against the greatest threat Ferelden has ever faced. And we shall triumph over it, for we are Ferelden. Yeah, and you're all being led by me. I'm a great general. I can prove that. With the constant body count. <laughs> ah. oh, that was fun. I wish all politics were like that. Don't agree with me? Let's have a duel. Okay. You are called upon to submit yourself to the taint for the greater good. From this moment forth, you are a Grey Warden. I understand moment of truth wow we're all just gathered around so it's done my father lives and for good or ill he is now a grey warden thank you for giving him the opportunity to undergo the ritual it couldn't have been easy <sighs> he has a lot to redeem himself for. I'll give you that. A lot of work ahead of him. He does indeed. And my future husband is upstairs, no doubt glaring out of the window and pouting. Ah, he you'll get used to it. So much like we him, all did. It's disturbing. I'll talk. I'll go talk to him. 
If you like. I suspect he's not apt to be very receptive in that mood. Yeah. Al Eman has left. I never really cared much about his mood. And tells me that our armies have almost fully gathered there. I will be heading there myself. Bring your companions and join us at Redcliffe Castle as soon as you are able. You have united for Elden Warden. Now we face the blight. Yep. I did some good work. Oh, my friends are gone. Okay. Let's see. What do I level up? I guess dexterity. And... Um, I do want momentum. So why not momentum? Let's, let's work towards momentum. There we go. Alright, real quick, let's just go talk to Alistair. Make sure he doesn't spend the rest of his life whining and moaning. Hey, buddy. Guess who's here to talk to you? It's your old buddy. Oh, there you are. Come to offer congratulations, I suppose? In a way. Maybe you intend to throw me a party to celebrate my engagement. Will you accept a stripper cake? Come on, man. You you had to agree. This had to be for the best. I get that you think so. Loghain let all the Grey Wardens die. Let his king die. All because he thought he alone could defend Ferelden against the dreaded Orlesians. No matter what your plans are, he deserved to die. He deserved justice. And you made him one of us. Okay, I get the feeling that you're in a very, very bad mood. Now just calm down. Let's see. This is a chance for him to make things right. There is no way to make that right. No way at all. But why should I complain, right? I'm the king now, and with a beautiful fiancé who is going to remind me of her father every time I look at her. I'll make the best of it, I guess. I'm not going to roll over and let Honora rule, that's for sure. Well, good luck, I suppose. You have a lot to do now. And so do I. Well, that was uncomfortable. <clears throat> and we're done here. Goodbye, Denerim. It's been fun. You give me a lot of good memories and bad ones, but memories nonetheless. Let's see. Obvious, huh? I guess I should bring Logan. Or maybe not. Maybe later. I'll deal with him later. Let's see Indeed. Morgan, Ogren, and Zevron. Yes. Oh, that's the end of the lands, mate. Ugh. Let's see what's next.